as of today, two interstellar objects have been observed entering our solar system. The first went by the name of Oumuamua, and the second has been called C-2019 Borisov. Going back on the 19th of October 2017, astronomers in the scientific world were amazed when they noticed an object travelling through our solar system. The object in question had come from another solar system and was quickly given the name of Oumuamua. What stood out about this object though is that it seemingly appeared out of nowhere, which in turn caused many to ask questions. When researchers were able to lock onto the object, they could see it travelling around the sun and then shooting away again. However, after this it was not to return. Astronomers were able to record data on the object for a short period of time. After looking at the data it turned out that Oumuamua was in our solar system for around a century. The reason Oumuamua wasn't spotted until the last minute is because it wasn't close enough to reflect enough light for astronomers to pick it up. Even when it did get close enough it was moving very fast, and meant astronomers had very little time to observe it. Once the strange object flew around the sun it was going further away, meaning it was getting fainter and fainter. The astronomers' very last observations from Hubble were on the 2nd of January 2018. On the 3rd of May it was then seen outside of Jupiter's orbit. Now though a second interstellar object has been observed by astronomers. It's been called Comet C2019Q4. It's also named after the astronomer that discovered it, a man called Gennady Borisov. After other researchers were able to see the object, they noticed it was on a hyperbolic orbit. This is something that suggests it wants to get away from our solar system, and therefore means it didn't remain in our solar system. As you can imagine, many people have asked why these interstellar objects are entering our solar system. Why is this happening now? Or has this been happening for decades and it's only been in the last few years that we've been able to pick up on it? Astronomers decided to carry out further tests and were able to pick up on some of the object's characteristics. There's been a lot of speculation as to what this object is. A recent announcement has been made by scientists, and they said the comet revealed no signs of techno signatures, essentially meaning there's no advanced intelligent life on the celestial body. The news was released by the Search for Extraterrestrial Intelligence. However, as it's been pointed out, this is just one object out of many, and the likelihood is that there's life out there somewhere. It's just not on this specific body. Steve Croft of UC Berkeley's SETI Research Center said the following. If interstellar travel is possible, which we don't know and if they are motivated to build an interstellar probe, then some fraction greater than zero of the objects that are out there are artificial interstellar devices. Just as we do with our measurements of transmitters on extrasolar planets, we want to put a limit on what that number is. With technology at an all-time high, it's an interesting time for science and space exploration. So what do you make of this recent discovery? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comment section below, and help us by growing this community while working to solve these unexplained mysteries. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.